Yeah, Brent and Sarah, looking ahead to 2024, the district laid out goals like reducing chronic absences while continuing to improve graduation rates and student academic levels. But for this year, they're proud of what their community has done. Progress in Hartford Public Schools. Superintendent Dr. Leslie Torres Rodriguez sharing higher graduation rates among students. About 72% of the 2021 class walked across the stage, up from 2020, but just short of 2019. Graduation rates were up for all students. Multilingual and Hispanic students have the biggest improvement over five years. Our goal really is to instill in our students the importance of showing up. High schoolers who may have missed classes or fallen behind can make up credits during new summer credit recovery courses. They're also trying to provide a more consistent schedule for families. By reducing somewhat the number of half days on Wednesdays to provide more of a consistent schedule for our families, but also meet the needs that our staff have for their professional learning. Staffing levels have increased to about 90%, a 5% jump in a matter of months thanks to new marketing campaigns and monetary incentives. Carol Gale with the Hartford Federation of Teachers says that will help alleviate staff workload. She says the real results will show next year. And I do see that the district is hiring on a pretty regular basis. I also, we get calls from people who are resigning and saying, or I'm thinking about resigning. Families like this Hartford mom of two are happy to hear progress in Capital City Schools. She gives the district credit for communication over the last year, but wants to make sure all students are getting the same education. I'm really lucky that my kids got into a magnet school, and I know that, that there sometimes is a disparity between the neighborhood schools and the magnet schools. The superintendent did acknowledge areas that a union survey found where some staff members feel disconnected from district leaders, want more say in what they teach, and also better communication. The Hartford Federation of Teachers says that these are things they've been asking for for years now. The superintendent saying that they're going to try to work to get better at it. Live in Hartford, Tony Black, Fox 61 News. All right.